Welcome back to Classic Game Room, where we now have a black hole inside our space station, which is dangerous. Usually, you like to keep black holes outside your space station and avoid them, but uh, now we have one in here. But we're talking about a video game today called Mini Ninjas on the PlayStation 3. TJ, what's Mini Ninjas all about? I assume it involves little ninjas. Diminutive ninja, in fact. And my primary problem with the game was that they used the wrong plural of ninja. It's like oxes, except they're not oxes, they're oxen. So would they be ninjin? No, they are ninja. I like ninjin. I'm just gonna make up my own language. Which is weird because in the same breath they use the correct plural samurai. Which in the singular is samurai. How does the game play, TJ? The game plays like a very interesting little adventure where you have a ninja of a team of six that you'll assemble throughout the course of the game. You've got your standard ninjutsu tricks. You can cast spells, you can throw shuriken and fireballs and some fantastic acting right there. Thank you. You're welcome. I was a ninja in a past life. Not a very good one though. The gist of the game is that your village has been overrun by an evil shogun who is turning all sorts of furry woodland creatures into evil samurai. I thought you were going to say into evil sandwiches. I'm like, well, that's not a bad thing. Yeah, a little gamey, but then again, that's why we're here. This is a downloadable game for PS3, 360. It's also yep. available on the DS. Mm -hmm. uh, what's the gameplay like? Who is Mini Ninjas for? Well, it's a great little action game. It's got plenty of breadth to the gameplay. The areas are wide open and great for exploration. So if you want to just get your hands dirty and grab your katana and slash open some samurai and reveal cute foxes and rabbits, and it's almost like Sonic the Hedgehog in that respect. You deal with the baddies and then all of a sudden, poof! little cute things that you can then possess and use on reconnaissance missions. Okay, is it, is it a sizable game? Will it take people a while to play? It's got a good bit of depth to it. How about replay value? Anything online, scoring, what keeps people coming back? Well, at the end of each stage, you're shown just how many of the animals you've rescued, how much of the coin you've managed to collect, and how many of the little statues scattered around the place. Silence! How many of the statues about the place you've managed to pick up. The black hole machine taunts us every minute. I have to put it in its place. Do you dare enter the black hole? Do you dare enter the world of mini ninjas? Do you recommend the game? It's a cute and fun little diversion if you're looking for something like iNinja for the PS2, only without Stimpy. 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 I I, log. Wow, I just I think of Log. <laughs> hey, Log is great. It's a ninja game. You'll probably find a couple logs. It's big, it's heavy. It's wood. It is. Mini Ninja, Ninja Assassins have never been so adorably cute. Much as they've tried.